Come Par quoi on commence Serious suggestions, please. I'm not trying to write a thriller here. It's supposed to be an essay, you understand? An essay that means roman. facts and logic. Well, if it's facts and logic you're after, you shot yourself in the foot with your choice of research topic, didn't you? The Tataris soon a mystery. When so much remains unexplained, there's little to be objective bon, about. Unless, là, of course, you restrict yourself to textual <laughs> criticism. Yeah, well, this is my teacher's area of research. I can't change that. But it's fascinating enough des without des having to sensationalize it, don't you think? The strange location, the missing details, a mysterious person... I want to write cool. my essay on something interesting, and I'm interested in getting to the bottom of all this. That's the only reason I came to you. Yes, you came to me. So all the more reason to take my advice. The fact is, it's the dramatization that will make people want to read it. There's no getting around that. Ok, la mise en scène. Ok. J'arrive pas à comprendre s'il si écrit un roman ou si on lui a donné un roman. Did one of them just mention Tatara Suna? But that's all the way in Imazuma. Is it just Paimon or is it kinda unusual for someone in Sumeru to want to write a paper about this? Ah oui, c'est une ok. <sighs> Everyone here is just going about their business. Mais great, let's go find out what this Tatara Suna mystery is all about. Ok. So. Alright, I guess I'll go with my textual criticism and your editorial direction for the first draft. I have a feeling that ouais, the missing okay. Kabuki Mono will thèse. end up being the main focus of this paper. Ugh. If only we knew where to find that traveler. From what they say about ah, him, bah, voilà. this seems like the kind of thing he'd know about. Quand on parle du loup. Oh, you're the traveler, you say? Eh oui, c'est nous. Mm. Hey, what's with that face? Crois pas. Don't believe us? No, no. Of course I believe you. Actually, I first heard about your great exploits when I was ah, still bah, in this is my first time coming face to face with you and your mysterious silver-haired companion. I couldn't believe my luck. On a fait que and as a force of habit, I started uh, examining the evidence. Sorry. Oh, so what? For the love of... <laughs> Sorry, we don't get out much, so our social skills are kind of lacking. Yes, it's COVID. He rest in his Traveler, I hear you've helped many people a great deal and been to many places. Would you be able to tell us about Tatarasuna? Actually, we don't know much about that place either. In fact, we only came over here because okay, we heard on va you tous talking aller, about it and wanted to learn more. Tatarasuna. Uh, I see. My teacher chose this area of research as a personal challenge. He said it's difficult to get into because even Inazumans don't know much about Tatarasuna. If you don't mind, I'd love to show you all my outline for the book I'm writing about Tatarasuna. Uh, hold on, Sawada. Don't you think that's a bit of a deep dive for a first read? No, oh, fair point. In that case, please ease yourselves in gently by taking a look at Akaba's latest essay draft. Let me give you some background. This all started with the discovery of some records in Tatara Suna. The writings mentioned okay, someone by the name of Mikoshi Nagamasa, who crafted it in même. the end, he threw it into a fire to destroy it and killed his servant Katsuragi. Why? Well, no one knows. Apart from the sword maker, his servant, and the one who wrote this all down, the records also mention a kabuki mono. This seems to That's right. Akaba's teacher has spent quite some time researching these events on the ground. This kabuki mono lived in Tatara sooner for a while before disappearing without a trace. And shortly afterwards, as Akaba meant So first the strange person goes missing, then a murder happens? Ouais, c'est louche. Mm, Il y a un crime, euh, le mec yes, qui s'est barré. Yes, exactly. So I helped out too. I asked everyone I could think of if they knew anything about what happened back then. And wow, did I get lucky! Stop shouting! Putain, il est en colère, hein, le coco, là. I just wanted to make it stand out. It just so happens that a friend of mine works at the government records office. He looked into it for me, and I can now confirm that all the aforementioned individuals did, in fact, live in Inazuma over 400 years ago. Il est motivé, il a, il a, il a des preuves solides. Already at the center of Inazuma's smelting industry, the man in charge was a government official named Niwa. Wait, so there are two missing people in the story now. 
Ah, merde. That's right. What's more, Niwa is a name with a lot of history to it. Have you ever heard of the great swordsmith clans of Inazuma? Oh, ah oui, oui, on connaît ça. Yeah, um, like Ishin, La Rishin. Ah ouais, on a eu une quête avec ça. Wow, yes, you really know your stuff. That makes things easier. So basically, this Niwa was a distant relative of the Kaidahara clan, the last practitioners of Ishin art. Something then seems to have happened in the Kaidahara clan, leading to their downfall. I don't know the details, but taken in light of everything else going on around that time, it makes you wonder whether it's all connected. The Kaidahara clan? Voilà, le clan Kaidahara. So you left out the biggest detail of all. Oh, yes, of course. How could I forget? Brace your minds, ladies and gents, for they are about to be blown. Or maybe you won't believe your ears. I wouldn't blame you, of course. Okay. In all my years as a writer, this is by far the most. Get to the point, for Pete's sake. According to information acquired by Akaba's teacher, the Kusumoto was de fou. not a human, but a puppet. Ah, mais ça, on a vu ça. Enfin, on connaît. A puppet. <rire> la marionnette de la Shoken, voilà. Ah ouais, la Shoken, elle avait une marionnette. Scaramucha. Aha! Judging by the looks on your faces, you. Uh... <rire> Et ouais. Uh, no, enfin, non. The way you described it makes it sound like a ghost story. I agree, it does. <laughs> but considering that non-human races in Inazuma are by no means uncommon, spooky events are to be expected. Oh, and please read my essay draft as well. Sawada was encouraging me to follow his more creative approach, but I think essays should be grounded in facts. I don't think explaining everything away with mysterious forces will cut it. Oh, ouais, lui veut des faits, il veut des trucs concrets. Si je plug les holes dans Sawana's narrative avec une intrigue politique, comme je pourrais mettre un turf war entre les rivales factions au centre de la whole série de. Attends, tu es juste faire des choses Je suis sûre que tu as passé de l'essai à l'essai là. Akaba, regarde, ton teacher a recherché ça extensivement. J'ai reçu à tout le monde que je pouvais penser. Toutes les nous avons maintenant, c'est tout ce qu'il y a à savoir. This is as much detail as you're ever going to get. Besides, if there really was a political power struggle going on at anything like the level you seem to be suggesting, what hope would we ever have of finding out the truth? Ah, good point. Okay, back to the drawing board, I guess. Give me some time. I need to find a new angle on this. We have some other stuff to do, so we'll have to say goodbye. As a chow, all right. Thank you. If you find out any more info about all this, please do let me know. Thanks so much. Good dial. Okay. Alors c'est quoi la suite? Hey, so du coup, euh, the thing they were talking about it has to do with the toujours Scaramucha. Okay, then even if we did know something about it, we probably couldn't share it with them, huh? After all, we kicked his butt and got him locked up. Information about people like that is usually super confidential, isn't it? If you ask Paimon, Akaba should just pick a different topic. There must be as many essay topics as there are trees in the forest. There's no point in. Est-ce que nous on va on va changer? Oh, what? Ou qu'est-ce qu'il fait là? Ah Attends, c'est lui? Mr. Scaramuccia. Ah oui, c'est bien lui. C'est pas, pas vraiment lui, c'est une illusion. 